what's going on everybody? It's your homeboy Keeplin Network and now I'm chilling out Max now. How are you doing today? Okay guys, now in this video we're gonna be talking about GTA 5 and the graphics. Okay, now before we get into that, guys, we are a YouTube network. I want to hire you to make money off your channel. Link in the description below, get sponsored on YouTube, Twitch, Instagram, Facebook. Get paid to bring people to our network. We are the only sponsorship out there like that. Capelot okay, Network, the new revolution. Okay, alright guys, now that that's out the way, let's get into the graphics. Okay, now basically this new perspective first person mode will give you a better view of the improved graphics throughout the game including a denser pedestrian population meaning there'll be more people on the street and traffic there'll be even more cars honestly that denser traffic is going to annoy the fuck out of me i already hate the traffic in grand theft auto 5 as it is um a further draw distance and a more complex weather system which basically means that it'll randomize more between rain sleet snow sun going up so you, you, you get what i'm saying anyway guys now with the pc gamer yes the pc gamers the epic gamer of course you know pc is going to get the best graphics because pc can actually enhance the graph you can go into your pc take it apart put in a better ram put in a better graphics card and then you can run a game that you originally could not run at all and xbox if i put anything new in there they're banning me offline so of course you know pc is going to have the best everything to me pc is the best thing for gaming honestly compared to consoles when pcs consoles with um first person shooters they aim a lot slower than you do on pc and it's not as accurate either okay now um let's get back into this sorry about that i guess love pc games but anyway now pc uses well with high-end rigs are going to get the best visual as the pc port supports cranking up the resolution from the console's max of 1080p all the way up to 4k now it will also change how you experience the story as events that take place in a mission happen around you rather than a zoomed out view originally okay prime example remember how when trevor had to shake that guy off his plane now in the trailer it actually showed you in the plane looking at him but in the regular game you were actually in a third person view of it Guys, put in the comments what you think about this. I am excited for it. I can't wait. I really just can't wait. When I get Grand Theft Auto for the next gen console, I know what I'm looking forward to. Awesomeness. Awesomeness. All right, y'all. Peace out. Talk to Lisbon Cape Line Network here. Make sure to like this video, comment below everything you want to ask me. Every I want. I just want to hear from you guys. I want to hear what you think about this. I want to hear how you think uh, first person mode will really interact with third person mode. I want to hear it. Alright, peace out y'all. Talk to ya. Laters!